This is a video from eSkills Zone. For more videos, notes, and certificates, please visit www.eskillszone.com. Hello and welcome. Hi, viewers. Today, in this video, we will learn how to do the settings transitions to the slide. For this, you must know what is the definition of transition. So, we'll drag our mouse to the transition tab and we will click on it this way then you can see the transition it is actually the movement uh, with several various uh, multiple uh, transitions are available in this transition to the slide group in transitions tab so when we click on the transitions tab then in the transitions to this slide group we'll click on the down arrow this is the down arrow to select the type of transition so when we drag the mouse over then you can see that choose a special effect that will be applied during the transition between the previous slide and the current slide and when we drag the mouse to this option more then you can see we can read it out what it says it says that choose a special effect that will be applied during the transition between the previous slide and the current slide so viewers you can see that now we can have a look on all the types of transitions available in the transition to this slide group so we will click on any of many options we want to select and we can also apply the same transition effect to all the slides by clicking on the apply to all buttons so we're gonna select ripple one and then when you click on it then you can see that it has um it's its effect on the transition like if we click on the honeycomb it has a different transition like glitter has its own vortex blinds clock so it moves like in a clock like a clock moves shred switch flip gallery cube doors box zoom Pan, first wheel, conveyor, rotate, window, orbit, and the last one is the fly through. So, viewers, you have just seen the number of transitions available in the transition to this slide group, and you can apply it to your slide. And uh, we can see the slideshow of our presentation with the transition efforts by clicking the preview button in the transition tab. So this is the preview button. And we're going to select a different one like here in this case. Uh, we are going to select uh, a versatile one, a different one, which has a good effect. On our slide like uncover is a good one covers used to cover and flash dissolve checkerboard and then in you can see that the ripple is very ah okay we're gonna apply on it so we can click on the preview button to see the preview of the transition for this slide when we click on it then we can see that we can always have the preview of this you can also uh, uh, see the preview from this button by clicking on it or you can just press the same transition button from here when you click on it you can see the transitions applied so if we select the effect options from the transition to this slide group viewers then you can see that it has a different type of effects this way center one 
from bottom left from bottom right and from top to right from top left and you can add a sound to it like if you click on it like it has a different sound like you can even have the sound as well if you increase the duration then you can always increase the duration and you can see that how it works if you click and increase the duration then it will the transition will move slowly like this but if you want to show it a little faster then you can always and decrease the duration like two two and a half then it works a little faster advanced slide and mouse click if you click on the mouse then the slide works and after how much time you can give all this give the time that after clicking on the mouse and after how many minutes and seconds the transition works on the slide so i think you find my video helpful for learning transition setting transition to the slide and that's all and thanks for watching